Hello everybody, this is Maniac for Bricks, also known as Joey, and I have a lot of random memories that jog around in my head on an almost daily basis, but some of them are a little less clear to me from my childhood and have been jogging around for many, many years. Sometimes I'm able to find some kind of lead on them, and other times, not so much. There's only some big memory of it that gets stuck in place, almost like a snapshot that I don't know how to build around it or explain it any further when researching it online. And so I've created this video series to help out with any of those kinds of memories of all different kinds of things. Whether it's events that I've attended, locales that I've been to, mostly in the northern New Jersey area, uh, any TV shows that I've watched or programming that was on TV channels that I watched growing up, or any products that I've played with, it could be toys, games, whatever it was around me when I was a kid. So hopefully this video series will keep some clarity on those things, and hopefully the video spread of this uh, memory will actually help other people who may remember this, who may have documentation about it, or has some kind of lead as to where it can go. I do appreciate all the help and support as I go through the random parts of my memory which come up almost on a daily basis. Thank you for joining me, and now on to today's video. Our next memory is something very fuzzy. I'm not entirely convinced on the explanation that I have before you, but it's been sticking around in my head long enough that I almost believe it to be real. It could have been a dream, it could have been two other things that got mashed together in my memory, I'm not entirely sure if it's actually real, but I'm going to go with it and see if anything comes up from it. I remember when I was a kid, growing up in the late 90s and early 2000s, I watched TV from the other side of my room. I had a long bedroom, and I had the bed right near the door. I would have the TV on the opposite side. So a very small CRTV would also be very far away, and hence not a lot of clarity as far as what I'm watching, if I'm sitting in bed watching it. I have a faint memory of late at night watching something on TV that seemed very similar to the Adrenalini Brothers. Now that part itself took me a long time to find out what it was. I remember that it was some kind of cartoon with a whole bunch of daredevil characters in red, white, and blue outfits moving across different things, sometimes one being more of a dummy figure than the other, and that it would be just the test subject or the daredevil itself or the others were just setting up the, uh, the act itself. The Adrenaline Brothers, at least I got that part right. Now here comes the weird part. I don't know if this was exactly an episode of the Adrenaline Brothers, which used to be a series of shorts from Sunday Pants on Cartoon Network, and why it would be premiering at late at night. I want to say this was after sunset. I don't know at what time exactly, but I do remember this being on basically with nothing else in the room around me lit. So, uh, the way that I remember this is that one of the Adrenaline Brothers, I don't remember him by name and I'll try to put it up on the screen, to give some clarity to it, but it's kind of like a like thin, tall one um, that didn't really speak any words. He just kind of made little high-pitched squeals. Um, he was with a helmet, sitting in some sort of bobsled. He was coming down a hill, and you could see that it was going towards a ramp and possibly through a hoop or something like that. Some kind of stunt. But in that moment, when he was going down the hill, there was the music playing Touch Me, by the doors. I remember specifically the opening starting of the song was playing as it was going down and basically getting to the first couple lines of the song itself. I don't know if this was just a mashup of two different memories, if this actually was a thing, some kind of weird bumper at the time, and considering the Cartoon Network does run a lot of later programming into the night, it may be possible that my TV was just left on and somehow this was there, or it could just be something I completely made up. Could have been from a dream. I had a lot of weird dreams growing up, including one about Krusty the Clown visiting me in my bed and offering me a plate of cookies. Because I was definitely uh, <laughs> terrified of Krusty's Funhouse. I didn't even watch The Simpsons as a kid, but that happened. I just did not like the opening for Krusty's Funhouse and the look of him on the box, but yeah, he was a little bit of a nightmare for one or two nights. So, hopefully this Adrenaline Brothers bumper comes to some fruition. If there's any kind of clarity for it, let me know in the comments down below, and uh, let's try to put this thing to bed. 
even though young Joey could not go <laughs> and put himself to bed. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later.